Welcome back to the Hank Strange Situation, Lifestyles of the Locked and Loaded. Make sure to check out HankStrange.com. You can sign up for our email list and find ways to follow and support our efforts. I can't be president um, because I wasn't born here unless we have the uh, Schwarzenegger rule or whatever goes oh. into effect. But if I could be president... Um, Actually, I would abolish the ATF, Vince. I gotta say that. I gotta say that. I know. I know you don't like that, but I would abolish them. But if I couldn't abolish them, I would make you the head of the ATF. Who would you have enforce the federal firearms law, or you'd abolish the federal firearms law? Yeah, I, I'm tired of all that crap. It doesn't. It doesn't make any difference. A lot, it doesn't of, do a lot, anything. A lot of. A lot of it. Yeah. A lot of. Yeah. It. Yeah. But if I could, Vince, you'd be no, the man to run no, that. No. 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 <laughs> No, no, no. <laughs> so, if you're a three-time violent convicted felon, mm -hmm. and you still choose to go out and get your hands on a gun and commit a crime, I promise you, you we'll stop it. You know how we'll stop you it? You should not be subjected to life in prison. No, uh, Shredder. No, three, t three times Shredder. violent, you should have been hung already. Shredder. You should have been hung on the second one. I believe in Shredder. Shredders. So Chip so we're going to kill you? <laughs> yeah. We're not going to give you due process. We're not going to prosecute. No, we'll give, we'll give you, oh, we'll, 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 process, yeah, we'll give you due we'll, process. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> we'll duly process you right through that chipping machine. <laughs> because after two times. Yeah. Know, Listen, I believe stuff. I'm not, I'm not going to pull. I'm not going right, to pull. Just, I'm not pulling a Trump. <laughs> You I'm just not, I am not pulling a Trump here. I would give the dude due process, but how many times are we going to let you violate yeah, how society? Many <laughs> how many times? But, but you have to have a law. You have to have somebody to enforce that law. So you did away with ATF. So now who's going to go well, out and on. get that armed career criminal? Hang on, hang on, hang on. The, Vince, before we, before yeah, technically. I, before, Technically, before we had ATF, that was all I, taken care listen, of. Listen, I think when the FBI. people have machine guns, the bad guys are going to get shredded anyway. That's my opinion. If the people can have I machine can, guns, the bad I guys can. are getting shredded. You abolish the ATF, and you have the, quote, armed career criminal, three violent prior felonies, who now has a gun... And I can put him away. You know, you know what I think? I think the worst thing that happens in societies, if you go back to like ancient Japanese society anywhere, every time they make it where only special people can have the the, the swords or the the bows and arrows or crossbows or whatever it is, we get this kind of we get this kind of nonsense going on. People, just not felons. Well, the thing is, is if you if you what what is a felon? Someone uh, basically a felon is someone violating society. So if you're trying to violate society and dudes can pull out their machine guns and shred you up, I think we're not going to have that that much. And if we do have it with this, th listen, I believe I believe in cops. I do believe in cops. I believe in law enforcement. But I don't. Think, the fact that the ATF the ATF is being the ATF the ATF is being used against us. The ATF is being used against us in a bad way, and it's just a tool. This is what it's turned into. It's look. Here's one. Of, here's one of my questions. It hasn't. Though. It hasn't. Ninety nine. Okay, I'll, I'll go with ninety. Mm -hmm. Ninety percent of the ATF cases made out there mm -hmm. are good, valid cases. I'm not talking about against the citizens with the ghost guns. And I'm talking about the dudes who are meeting gangsters. No bad guys out there and buying guns or selling guns or trading dope for guns or doing whatever. Those dudes need to go away. When you do away with ATF, who's going to do that? We have FBI, DEA. Oh, so you uh, want the this, FBI? No, 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 no. You, no, want, no. you want no. Big Brother? No, what I'm saying is we have too many law enforcement agencies. There's freaking, oh, there's freaking guys that work for the post office work, walking around with machine guns but and stuff like that. Good thing. That's a good thing to have it spread out and we don't have a national police force. Let me just say three things. KGB. We don't need like one god of gun rights or anything. We have an agency that now can be monitored, uh, monetized, 
we can take away or give them more budget. We don't. We yeah, we don't need gods of anything. We don't need gods. Of, listen, you know what, Vince? Uh, honestly, a straight up answer to this is if the if the ATF had guys like you in it running it, I I wouldn't really I, I wouldn't I wouldn't they really have a problem. Have guys like me though. That's my point. But the not, but the guys but the guys like you don't have it, the guys like you don't have the power. I think this is the story of what happened to I, you. A good guy I, like you got pushed out of that agency and basically they had you working for like what two years from home, not doing anything, not doing the, the right thing the day, out there. At the end of the day, that which I was doing mm -hmm. and I'm being self serving here mm -hmm. was advancing the cause of ATF. Because I was calling them out on their boat. If you don't have an ATF and nobody is overseeing, yeah, just give your guns away now. Because at least ATF was small enough that when Fast and Furious happened, for an example, or Waco or whatever, somebody was like, whoa, whoa, what do you guys think you're doing there? When, when it gets thrown into the abyss of the I, I think I think when no one really suffers for that, that's when the people lose faith right. in it. And I, I agree. Think, no one, I agree. But no there, was, there was, I won't say accountability, there was exposure. And... Um, and who paid the price? There's no, no, there's no one. There's no one that paid Again, the price except the people world. and except, you know, we had Americans, you know, we had guys who, yeah. you know, we had guys who in law enforcement, right, that paid the price for it. We had Americans pay the price and we had tens of thousands of people and we still have mm. tens of thousands of people in Mexico paying the price for us allowing those guns to go over there. It's not a perfect world, but you're right. But by transparency, or at least attempting mm -hmm. to hold this small agency accountable, everybody saw that every day. They saw um, Grassley and them holding up the redacted bull and raking them over the coal. Was it good enough? No, they didn't suffer. They didn't suffer any consequences, but it put the brakes on. And ATF went, whoa. We know it. of, that we know of. Um, I mean, Eric, I, 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 I hate to say that. Obama's yeah. still there. Eric Holder was yeah. still there. Eric Holder um, shouldn't Mar even Marvin, be. Mar yeah. Marvin Richardson that I met with in ATF, the synth director, he was there then. Um, yeah. He's a useless piece Marvin of Marvin Richardson <laughs> should be in jail. Yeah. Listen, let me. He, Jay Dobbins, he should be in jail. Again, not a perfect world. Let me do this. Yeah. Let me do. Let me do this because we got a limited amount of time here. Um, so our main axes gave us some money. Thank you, our main axes. There goes the cheers for that. Um, he says, "Too many laws <laughs> equals more and more less freedom." <laughs> <laughs> and more, <laughs> more, more bureaucrats and more bureaucrats. I agree. And more bureaucrats. Yeah, that's Let me, why we well, don't need more laws. We just need to enforce the ones we have so let's make sure to check out hankstrange.com you can sign up for our email list and find ways to follow and support our efforts